crazed here. This is a game called War C, and uh, yeah, this is pro uh, basically a zombie survival multiplayer game, and it's uh, still a beta, so it hasn't been released yet. But uh, I will give it a try. I'm all by myself now. Uh, I usually play with my friends in my clan. <coughs> but they are not here right now, so I have to do this on my own. I probably just die. Okay, so it's very dark outside. And I can see shit. So I don't even know where I am right now. Oh. So this is the map. If you haven't seen the game before. And uh, yeah, it's basically to survive. There's uh, there is of course zombies, and you have other players also to worry about. Zombies isn't the really the big threat in this game. The biggest threat is other players. So all I have is a hammer. Not a very good start, but it's better than nothing, you know. And yeah, I'm, s I'm playing on low graphic because if you're playing on high graphic or ultra or high. It's very hard to see because there would be a lot of more grass and yeah. So I am at the White Stone Mountain. And I don't really like the feeling about this. I don't see anyone. Oh, what the hell? The worst thing that can happen is that you die. And yeah, it's a permadev, so if you die, you lose your all your items, and so on. And they rec recently added that you can be intoxicated by zombies, so you get infected. And yeah, this game is still a beta, so... It's not 100% perf uh, percent perfect. There's still a lot of hackers. Got killed by one yesterday. That sucked. So yeah, everything matters in this game. To the top right corner you have hearing and how well they can see you. And to the bottom left we have food to the left and water to the right and of course your health. This game is pretty hard, if you're all by yourself, like me right now, but if you go in a group, it's become a bit easier, and yeah, I used to be a nice guy, I used to be a nice guy, I trusted everyone, and that's a very stupid thing to do. Because they can have like nothing, or they can have a lot of guns, or whatever. But if they don't have a gun, and you decide to trust them, as soon as they found a weapon, they just go behind you and shoot you in the head. And that sucked. So basically what I'm doing here is killing the zombies. I want to go over there. And I do get experience with this. There is no skill tree yet, but it's coming. Oh. Has been oh,
so yeah. Um, this is basically what you do. You just try to survive and... Oh, yeah, and you find items to survive. Food, water. Health potion. Uh, <laughs> not health potion. But painkillers, antibiotics and stuff. It's not that rare. And yeah. Guns are very rare though. can have like assault rifles and stuff but uh, I guess we'll find it someday <coughs> it doesn't seem like something's been here so I don't I think we're good <coughs> yeah, bandages and painkillers that is very good not bandages but Oh, right there. Oh, yes! I found a gun. I found a pistol. That is awesome. Well, I feel a little bit more safe now. But who knows? They can sneak up behind me, you know? If they do, a gun won't matter that much. This is a pretty bad thing. You can only have your gun in this place. A pistol. Which means you can't have a melee weapon at the same time that you have a pistol. So you have to switch over every time. Which sucks. Because if you go like this. And a player come out. You can't like <laughs> throw the hammer at them. Another gun. Hello. No. No. You're joking. Can you get rid of something? Yes, it's a backpack, I think. That would be awesome. I only have a small backpack and they don't have very much slots. Is there something here? That is good. That is very good. Oh my god, it's a large backpack. No! I have to drop someone. Hopefully, I won't die. I don't need that. I only have a pistol. Let's do this. Change backpack! You can only carry a special amount of weight in the different backpacks. You have more slots the bigger than that backpack is. Obviously. So hopefully I won't die the first thing I do. But who cares?
through this town now. I have not encountered any enemies right now. Yet. But it will come. Could go to Camp Splinter, but that's quite dangerous. Nah, let's go to Rocky Ford. And yeah, so there's there's three safe zones in this map where you can't be killed or killed, and those are Goblin Peak, Castle Pine Settlement, and Blue Ridge Settlement. City is Boulder City. I think we're heading there in the next episode, maybe. I don't know yet. It will be a surprise. What the? Oh, is it sign? I thought it was something hanging in the air. Would be pretty funny. He's like, I'm a hanging in the air. What you gonna do about it? Uh oh. You can't do shit, bro. So many zombies, god damn it. This is very bad. Why did I do this? This is not good. Holy fuck. Fortunately for me, I can run away from them. But yeah, as you see, when you sprint or something like that, when you make a lot of noise, they hear you very clearly and see you and you get very, very chased. Oh, you came to the party? Party, party, feel my hammer in your fucking face. Sorry. I got a little too excited there. I haven't encountered any enemies right now, or friendlies. I don't know if that's a good or bad sign. Probably good, but it means that I won't die, but if I do kill them, I get a lot of loot. Better weapons and stuff. Let's bring our pistol out. We don't want to walk around in the forest unarmed. I have no idea where I'm going right now. Going down here. I'm gonna follow this road to Rocky Ford. There's a lot of walking in this game, <laughs> and uh, if you're alone, it could be very boring. Or if you have like friends who spawn on the other side of the map, it's a very long way to go to meet up with them. But hey, it's worth it. Unless you die, of course. That wouldn't be <laughs> wouldn't be very funny. So yeah, people often cross this road or follow this road to different cities. So you need to be careful on these roads. I mean, it's a very open area, and you can easily just go here and bam, you're dead. That is not funny. <sighs> so, yeah. Is 
Is this boring? Is this boring to watch? Is it? Is it? Well, too bad for you. Just skip it. Because I don't think anything will happen here. There's just eight players in. With me. So there's seven different people I should worry about. And yeah, I'm a uh, Shiena fan. I'm a thug. I kill people. Bad or good. Zero zero forty nine. The sun will rise in about four hours. In game, four hours. Of course. So, yeah, we're just gonna follow this road. I think we can see it over there. Yeah, that's Rocky Ford. Just gonna do it like this. Put my binoculars. Binoculars is really useful. I mean, you can stand right here and. Oh, uh, yeah, it's night time now, but if it's daylight, you can just look like this and you can see people from miles away. Or if you have a sniper, that's good too. So, yeah. I'm gonna end this episode right here and uh, in the next episode we will go through this little town right there it's called Rocky Ford and uh, I hope it will be great fun thanks for watching and see you in the next episode bye bye I see